Hey, this is Scarpad. This is my out of the theater reaction to the Blue Beetle. Uh, kind of torn on this one. I thought the cast was all pretty good on it. I liked everybody in it. George Lopez and the, the kid who plays Blue Beetle is good. And, um, and his family is pretty good. But, uh, overall, can't say I really enjoyed this one all too much. It's pretty generic. Um, it's really a mix of like Iron Man and Spider Man thrown in with a little bit of the George Lopez show with the family stuff. Uh, Susan Sarandon plays the villain. She's pretty one note in this. And there's nothing here that we haven't seen before in any other superhero movie. And I think that's that's the problem with a lot of these films and why people are tiring of them is, you know, the, the superhero genre is, you know, I love it myself. But back in the day, it was all, you know, pretty cookie cutter as far as, you know, you get the, your origin story and then... You know, everything happens afterwards. It's not a lot different. They didn't really do a lot to make this different than any of the other films. That's what you really, I think, have to do now. If you want to have a good uh, superhero movie is is give it some weight, give it some depth, make it a little bit different. And there's nothing really different here at all. Um, the CGI is okay. Um, you know, but it's it's nothing we haven't seen before. By the end, I was fairly checked out of it, to tell you the truth. Uh, while it's not a horrible movie, it just, there's nothing really to distinguish it. And, uh, how is it going to go? I don't know. I mean, I saw a lot of the Latino community in there and I think it's good for them to go and support the movie. I, I don't know, you know, they will have a lot of Hispanic superheroes, so I really would like to see it succeed, but, I, you know, I wouldn't blame them if they didn't get out because it's, it's in the end, it's, it's not a, a fantastic movie. It's just an okay movie. Um, one person was saying they thought it was better than Flash. I didn't think it was better than Flash. Um, I think it has has its good intentions, and it's okay if you want if you look for something to, to watch and there's nothing else in the in the multiplex. But uh, it it's really nothing that's going to change superhero fortunes. And maybe I'd like to see him kind of you know get away from superheroes and maybe just uh, go ahead and do. Uh, some non-superhero comics. Do that Texas blood. Something's killing the children. A whole range of stuff you could do. Let's get on that train for a while. So this is Scarpad for Scarpad's Domain. Thanks for checking out this video, and we'll catch you later.